Get ready for all the highlights of Valley High School football. It's time for Action for Sports Friday Sports Extra. Hello and welcome to Friday Sports Extra coming up over the next 15 minutes. Speed versus power as Sherilyn hosts Donna. PSJ North fights Edinburgh for second place in 31-5A and rivalry week with Harlingen and Harlingen South at Ed Couch Elsa Mercedes. That's a fantastic one as well. But first, San Benito believes it is their time to win the 32-5A crown. They don't care who they have to go through to do it. Brownsville Pace begged to differ and they had the home field tonight. Action 4 Sports reporter Brandon Fitzgerald live at Sam Stadium in Brownsville. Thank you. Clay, uh, just week two of the district season in 32-5A, but a giant game about as big as they come here at Sam Stadium this Friday night against Brownsville Pace hosting on homecoming the San Benito Greyhounds. Let's take a look at some of the highlights. Pace entering the game a perfect 4-0 in the season, both entering the game 1-0 in district. It was the Greyhounds that got off to the quick start. They go right down the field. Jacob Puente with a big gainer here. QB keeper on the left side gets a first down and later on the drive he'd punch it in himself a one yard touchdown makes it one nothing Greyhounds in the first quarter pace would respond after that Adrian Alejandro up and over the pile for the touchdown it was 7-7 they went to the half 10 to 10 tied up because Puente's pass tipped and intercepted that was in the last 10 seconds of the first half so they went in deadlocked pace came out in the third quarter on fire Dustin Hernandez giving it to Adrian Alejandro again Ale Alejandro 30 yards for the touchdown to the right side. That gave pace. They were up by 10, 20 to 10, but in the third quarter, late, Puente starts the comeback, just gets it over the goal line for the touchdown. That made it a three-point ball game, and then Arturo Coronado took over. This one down the right side, 30 yards for the touchdown. He had another one from 40 in the late minutes, and San Benito gets a huge win, 31 to 20, the final over Brownsville pace, and I'm joined by the late hero, Arturo Coronado, running back for the San Benito Greyhounds. Already talked to me about those two touchdowns. You guys have had success with that play all year. It finally broke for you guys in the fourth quarter. Yeah, the O-line executed, and the receivers blocked and did their assignments. So they, they got me in the end zone, and I want to grant credit for that. What kind of a win is this? I mean, not just a district win, but against Brownville pace on the road. What does this do for you guys? Well, we really needed this win because we need, a, we, want, we need to win that district championship this year. And the defense just put, put, for us, put it for us. Awesome, man. Congratulations. Great win. Two touchdowns, 70 yards combined on those scores. Arturo Coronado, the San, Benite, San Benito Greyhounds, who are 31-20 winners. They are 4-1, and one, but more importantly, 2-0 in District 32-5A. Clay, back to you. All right, big comeback win for San Benito down and a big win for Spencer Gantz Greyhounds tonight.